Hello everyone. The total number of item and quantity app is the powerful tool that helps business easily track the number of ordered quantity, number of delivery quantity and number of invoiced quantity of the item in the sales as well as in the purchase order. Also can see the number of demanded quantity and the number of done quantity for the inventory. Now let's get into the sales to see how it actually works. So from here let's create a new quotation. Let's add the customer and we need to add and two more products in the add line. Okay. Now I had added two products. Okay. Let's add a product with the quantities. Yes. Now I have added two products. Now you can see that number of ordered quantity will be two. Let's confirm it. So once you can see that delivery order will be created. So if you have validated, you can see a number of delivery quantities right away here. So let's validate it okay so from here we need to click on and validate and just click on the apply you can see it will be done so now let's get into and sale order again where you can see a number of delivered quantity will be two now let's create an invoice for this created sale order okay so from here you can see if i have confirmed you can see that it will be showing a number of invoice quantity will be two okay so you can see there is an ordered quantity, delivery quantity and invoice can be seen from the sale order page. And like the same way, if we get into a delivery order, okay, where you can see a demanded quantity as well as the done quantities right away here. And now let's get back to the purchase. So from here, let's create a new purchase order. Let's add a vendor and the products. Okay. So once everything is done, you can see that number of ordered quantity for the purchase will be 2. Now let's confirm it. You can see that in our receipts will be created. Now let's validate it. So once this is done, let's get into the purchase order where we can see and received quantity will be 2. Now for this created purchase order, let's create and bill. So from here, let's confirm it. Okay. Yes, we need to give the bill date. So let's give the bill date as 5. Okay, let's process the payment as well. So here you can see before uh, processing the payment also we can see and billing quantities right away here in the number of billing quantity. That is on the purchase order we can see a number of ordered quantity, received quantity as well as the billing quantity. In this way we can make use of this module to track the number of ordered quantities, number of delivered quantity and number of invoice quantity of the items in the sales and purchase order. If you have any query regarding this video, you can ask in the comment box. We will definitely solve your queries. And if you feel this video is helpful to you, you can like this video and subscribe our YouTube channel for more Odoo related updates.